Well, welcome everybody. Welcome to April. Cannot believe it is, we're heading into the second quarter. <laughs> so we always start out our team calls with some wins. So I would love if someone, a few people want to unmute, share a win, pop in the chat. Um, don't forget to remind your people to hop on because I want to keep increasing the numbers on our calls. Who's game for sharing a win? I rebanked senior gold and flew to 322 points. Yay! <laughs> that is awesome, Laura. Congratulations. Yeah. Melody says too many to count. <laughs> Melody's team was rocking and rolling last month. Nice. Who else? Who else? Pop in the chat if you're not able to share a win. If you're able to put your video on, we always enjoy seeing faces. I will. Couple oh. people started sharing that hadn't previously. Yay! That's awesome. Yeah, share you know, in the comments too, like tag a teammate. Pop in the chat what you what rank you hit or highest points or teeny tiny wins like it can be anything and everything. Okay, I'll share a few stats from the team. So let's see. We had 38 watch earners. So pop it in the comments if you were a watch earner. Congratulations. That means you added six friends in the month of March, at least six. Also, we had seven double earners and we had three triple earners. So Candace Harris. Maylee and Sarissa all triple earned that incentive. So congratulations, you guys. We had, okay, hang on to your hats. So if you're new to our team calls and you have no idea what I'm talking about because I'm talking about rank ups, um, I will share numbers here real quick. So we had 30 people go silver. So congratulations to all you new silvers and fast start silvers. That is the first rank in Plexus. That's when you help three friends get started, three VIPs get started. And if you are fast starting, that means that you earned a $300 bonus. Also, um, the rank for going silver is $100. And it actually doubles if you do it fast, which is so fun. And then there's some other extra bonuses that you get. Um, we had 14 people go senior silver. So kudos to all of you guys. And senior silver means that you helped nine friends get started or you helped, you know, six friends maybe and helped someone go silver. There can be, you know, different ways of ranking up and making that happen you, you could go you know help three or sign three and then help two people go silver to equal those nine so there's lots of different combinations and when you go senior silver you actually get a 150 dollars bonus and if you do it fast like you do the fast start senior silver you get double of that so you get a 300 dollars bonus which is so so cool um we had seven people rank up to gold and that is approximately 17 people for easy math we could say 20. we all have 20 friends right that need flexus so we're actually encouraging everybody to go so to go uh, well silver yes but to go gold and we had seven people do that last month so this can be encouragement that you guys if seven people can go gold more of you can go gold if 30 people can go silver all y'all's people on your teams can go silver also we had four people rank up to senior gold two people go ruby and then we had a, a senior ruby rita dotson went senior ruby Madison Ambrosetti went emerald, and then Angie Ambrosetti went sapphire. And so I hear that there is some sort of shindig going on right now. Otherwise, they would be on this call. But um, yeah, I wanted to give a quick shout out. Yes. All right. So please keep keep popping in the chat with you your wins for the month. And you know what, guys? This is the time of month when I encourage everyone to reflect. Whether or not you tapped in last month or you in the month didn't pan out how you wanted, or even if it did, reflection is your best coach. And so is failure. <laughs> failure is a great coach. So is success. And so regardless of where you're at on the pendulum of <laughs> how you feel like your re reality matched your expectations or your intentions at the top of, of March, there are things to learn and pivot on. So if you have not reflected on quarter one as a whole, I would challenge you after this call and after our coaching call to write, like jot down your thoughts, jot down your, um, your goals for quarter two revamp reset. This is like a great reset time for your goals in your business. So I just want to encourage everyone to do that. It's something I, it's a practice I have every month and also every quarter It's kind of a benchmark anchor point. Um, and 
oh, I just had a thought. I'm cheering on the <laughs> coaching call here in a little bit. Um, it's just that little anchor for you and your business. And as entrepreneurs, like no, we don't have a boss telling us like, oh, well, hmm, you didn't hit the quota. Like you got to work harder or, hey, <laughs> we don't have that. Like the, the, the blessing about what we do is that it's pretty open-ended. It, we can create whatever we want. But sometimes that's a little hard, especially if you struggle with self-discipline or, you know, you have just a lot of things going in your life. I don't think that means that you can't make, you know, prioritize your plexus business, but I would just encourage you to get, get some stuff written down on paper, get it out of the kind of the nebulous and get it in a concrete format on a piece of paper. Okay. I want to challenge all of you guys. I have had this actually on my wall with other things, but I've had this on my wall since last April when Jessica Hefley actually challenged us to pray this blessing over Plexus and over our businesses in the month of April. So I'm going to challenge everyone to print it out and tape it on your bathroom mirror or tape it on your fridge or your, your wall next to your computer. And I'm just going to read it and you guys can pray it with me. It said, so this is from Psalm 67 and Psalm 90. So this is a blessing. It says, may God be gracious to us and bless us so that your ways may be known on earth, your salvation among all nations. May all the peoples praise you, God. O Lord, our God, let your favor rest upon us. Come work with us and then our works will endure. You will give us success in all we do. And so I have actually prayed Psalm 90, um, the last couple of verses since the beginning of our Plexus journey, just that specifically that God would magnify the hours in our day and bless the work of our hands. And guys, like if you take nothing else away from this call, just know that if the Lord is in it, you will be successful. And like success looks different from, for all of us, I realize, And the journey is part of the process. And so <clears throat> I'm just challenge you, if you haven't been praying over your business um, to do it this month and like God can literally direct you miraculously direct people to you and <clears throat> put people on your heart that need these products and that need the opportunity. So let's proceed with that intention as we work towards our April goals and just speaking that blessing out and praying it over our teams and our businesses. Okay. I'm going to actually kick it over to Brooke. She's going to share with us the fun April incentives. Hey everybody. Sorry. I have been painting. So if I have paint on me, just ignore it. Okay. Um, all right, so the incentive this month is a walking pad, which is super fun. I would like one and I'm redoing my gym right now. And so we're painting and doing all the stuff and I'm like, oh, perfect. So, okay, so you need to add six level ones or three level ones and develop a silver to earn the, the walking pad. Um, and then the, in, the coupons are, um, give 16 for $16 off the new order or, and I think that we still have saved 10 for anybody who didn't order last month, but that can be, if I understand this right, Megan, I think it's for all month, right? Like we can tell people now to order, to reorder and use that save 10. It's not like certain days you can just, correct. you can go yeah. ahead and use it now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. I think that's it. And of course the convention contest stuff keep going on those. Yes. We have one more month for convention contest. So yes. It ends, it ends April 30th. Is that right? The end of this month? Yes. Convention contest ends. Okay. Yeah, for sure. So that leads me to convention contest. If you guys haven't registered, I mean convention, just convention in general, if you haven't registered, go get registered. We're encouraging everybody to get registered and attend. It's June 18th through the 20th. And my encouragement is go register and get the details figured out later. Um, and I mean, there's ways to make it work. You can share rooms with other Plexus people on our team. <laughs> like um, we can travel together. Like there's lots of ways to make it work and be there. Also just wanted to make a little plug for Gold School. Lisa Stanley and Mandy Moyer and I met up at the gold school in Michigan two weekends or a week and a half ago. And it was so good. That is one of the best things that Plexus has going that you, when you hit the rank of gold or you develop a gold or you hit senior gold, you can earn these gold schools. And 
Mm. It's great training. It's just being able to just unplug from the vortex of life and go for a Saturday and get training by the tippy top people and Genevieve and her team. It's just so amazing. And it's so good. And it's great for your mental space and just, ha, huh, I went gold. Okay, now what? Okay. And so it really fills in that gap of like, okay, now what? All right, so I just want to make that plug there. There is another gold school coming up in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, May 4th. And there's going to be a lot of people from the team attending. I hear the main team is going and also different people from Ohio. It is, you know, a little more centrally located. So I would just encourage you guys to make it your goal to earn it. If you're not gold yet, make it your goal to go gold by the end of this month. All right, I'm going to kick it over to Laura Ferry, and she's going to tell us about the product of the season, which is sleep. So if you've never sleep. sleep, you got to add it to your subscription. Okay. Sleep. <laughs> Bill is sitting in the same room. And so there's an echo. Okay. Yeah. I'm going downstairs. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So sleep is one of the products that we've been using off and on since it was introduced last convention. Okay. And so not every night because I'm already sleeping really well, <laughs> but it is great to be able to have that as a extra resource when you are traveling. Okay. So traveling hotel, different bed, lots of noises, kids running down the hallway, extra craziness. Okay. And so it's awesome when you can get, um, for sure that you're allowing six to eight hours of sleep, mind you don't think you need to take that if you're just going to have a, a short night. Okay. So need to be allowing six to eight hours of sleep. And then, um, so it's really great for travel in that way. But then last night I actually took it knowing that the storms were coming. I'm like, I don't want to listen to thunder and storm all night long. And I took it and slept totally fine until first thing this morning. And when I got up, Bill's like, oh my gosh, how'd you think that night was? I'm like, um, I don't know. What do you mean? He's like thunder all night long. It was miserable. And I'm like, um, I took a sleep gummy. <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> So that was really funny, right? Okay. So anyway, um, it's a great price point. There's no reason not to have an extra bottle laying around or have a couple and that you can, you know, sell cash and carry or not feel bad about, you know, giving it away if you want to. But um, Dr. Hartman says about sleep that sleep, meaning like you are sleeping, the verb sleep, <laughs> um, not the product sleep the verb sleep. He says that your body absolutely resets during sleep. It needs that for functionality. Um, and that, you know, your body needs that rest while it's sleeping. And actually your gut health is really important when sleeping. Okay. So it, the sleep product helps you fall asleep faster and stay asleep longer. Okay. So that's like a, a, an easy little tagline, you know, if your customers are asking you about that, it helps you fall asleep faster, stay asleep longer, promotes quality, restorative sleep and supports us the healthy sleep cycle, which is incredibly important. Okay. So again, it is a product that's helpful for the gut microbiome and helping that, you know, stay balanced and supporting that quality sleep. So it has all the things that, you know, you're looking for in a healthy sleep product, meaning the five milligrams of melatonin, as well as some prebiotic fibers and um, the ashwagandha. It's actually a tranquil blend um, that contains some of the ashwagandha. So um, L-tryptophan. So for all of the people that are ingredient snobs, you can rattle those things off. I just heard sleep gummy tastes good. Use it when you need it. And I was in, I didn't need to, <laughs> didn't care about the details, but it's fun to recognize too, how many people are having so many problems, you know, with quality sleep and how that is actually also impacting their overall health. <clears throat> so 
Awesome. There's a couple of really great little one page flyer sheets on the website that you can print and have those available at your vendor events or in your new customer welcome packets, you know, that sort of things so just as an add on. Yes, 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 yes. And remind your customers and your teammates. That's a great little mention um, to for them to add it to their subscription this month. So get them signing it. Like there's nothing, yep. there's no rules where it, you cannot su suggest other products for your your customers to use. Like get them loving other things. They may already be buying melatonin from the health food store or from Walmart or something. So like, let's get them loving <laughs> the sleep gummies from Plexus. And my midwife actually was at a local event that we did in Robinson a couple of weeks ago. And she was like, I was researching like different ingredients for promoting sleep. And she's like, the Plexus sleep gummies have all of them. <laughs> she was so, she was such a little proponent of it. She's like, oh my, and my husband loves, the, loves these. So I'm actually going to do a giveaway. So there's 31 people on currently and more people may be popping on. So I'm going to do a giveaway of this. You, If you are brand new on our team call, I would love to gift it to you and drop a ship it. So message me privately, or if you're new and pop it in the chat, maybe someone can just Clue me in if someone comments <laughs> that you are brand new to our team call. I would love to get, drop that, sh drop ship one of these to you. So pop it in if you're new or tag your person if they're new. Okay. All right, Laura, did you have anything else to pipe in? Nope, sure don't. Okay. Neat. Oh, goodness. We're going to have to do a drawing. There's a bunch of people popping on that are new. Awesome. Sweet, sweet. Okay. All right, I'm gonna kick it over to Renee, actually. Speaking of new, Renee is brand new and I cannot wait to hear her share. Brandy, do you wanna introduce her? Are you able to, or are you in the middle of driving or traveling? <laughs> hey, I don't know if you can hear me, but I am here. So Renee is brand spanking new and she had a goal last month. She kept saying, I want that watch. And I'm like, let's go get it. Now we didn't make, make it to the watch, but Renee came in halfway through the month. The month was almost over <laughs> and she added four people lickety split. So this month she's got new goals, um, a new mindset. She's going to host an event. She's already got that scheduled. So, um, Renee, if you're on here, take it away. I am on here. Can you hear me? <clears throat> yep. You're good. All right. Um, so I'm just going to share a couple of things, I guess, um, of what I did. And really all I did was I just messaged people. <laughs> um, I literally just started messaging people like before I even got my product, like as soon as I ordered it, then I just started messaging people. And honestly, that was like really hard and really scary because I've done, you know, the selling stuff before. Um, I also sell Saint makeup and that has kind of brought me out of my shell a lot. Um, but before, like I did, you know, I mean, I don't even know, like I've done everything. Um, so just sharing something else, you know, that's whatever. <laughs> um, so it was just hard to uh, take that first step and to start messaging people. So what I started with was I just started with a list. I actually went through my phone contacts <laughs> and my Facebook friends. And I just made a list of that. And then um, I sent out a bunch of messages and some of them I still haven't got a response from. Um, I got a lot of no's um, and I've got, I don't know, I had like maybe 10 yeses um, because I was doing, um, Brandy did a Facebook event with me. So I was inviting to that as I was inviting to start Plexus. So, um, but really, I mean, that was about it. Just I just sent out a bunch of messages at first. Sweet. But what did you say? Can you tell us? Like, what was your message that you sent to people? Uh, Well, for the event, I was just like, hey, I'm having a Plexus event on Facebook if you want to join. And then um, I think I just said, like, hey, I'm starting Plexus. Um, you know, it's uh, this uh, gut health product. Um, and I left, like, you know, like the weight loss thing out of it for now because that's not exactly what it is at first or whatever you can add. I, I told them, you know, like you can add, you know, like weight loss supplements and stuff like that afterwards. But, um, I just focused on the triplex and like, I, that's what I, I was like, I just ordered this, the tried and true triplex system. And that's about it. About it. I just shared about that. 
Okay. And then you Can have- Can I interject real quick? Yes, please do. I, I just want to point out that Renee started sharing before she even got her box in because she yeah, was like messaging people- yeah. She was like, do this with me. She was very much yeah. like, Hey, I'm doing this, do it with me, which is something that we talk about a lot, but we don't see people actually doing it. So Renee was one of those people and she got four people to do it with her like in two weeks. So that was pretty amazing. Yeah. But yeah, it was quick. <laughs> very fun. So, okay. So if you guys were hearing what she said, she made a list. She um, did a party, an online party. And she sent invites out. She texted some friends. Did you also make a post? Yes, I've been um, sharing in my stories about every day I share my drink. And I sometimes I'm, I guess I make a reel mm -hmm. um, a lot and add a song. And I add a lot about God because that's, that was the main thing was I just, I trusted him from the very start to have the courage to share about it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love that. Love it. Okay. So those of you taking notes or those of you who are helping people go silver or share with some friends, um, a couple of key things. So she followed the PLLP system. She just said it in kind of a different way, but she made a post. She made a list. She, uh, did you do a live? She did a reel. She does stories. Okay. And she did a party. So the PLLP is the system that we basically help people through. And you probably didn't even know Brandy was doing that with you, but that that I've never, I've never heard of that before. <laughs> okay, so now you know. So now you can help your people do the PLLP if they're game, right? Some people come in and they just want a product experience, and that's fine. But some people, even if they do want a product experience, are at least willing to tell a buddy and do it do it with someone. I think also significant is the fact that you help four people get a free reset. So they're going to be doing the reset challenge with us in uh, this month, and they actually get a a free promo code. I don't remember, Brooke, if you mentioned that, but um, the people that started last month, they get a promo code to share with a buddy to do the reset with. So I think it makes that conversation so much easier. Um, even like for Renee, she was messaging people about the event that Brandy was helping to host for her. So I feel like that makes it casual and really um, easy to mention like, hey, we're doing this little pop-up Facebook event. I would love for you to pop on and just learn right? We're just plugging people into information. I so wish that there would have been something like that for me when I was looking into Plexus because, but there wasn't, <laughs> there really wasn't. And that's probably why it took me almost two years to say yes, just because I didn't really understand what Plexus was about. So Renee, congratulations. Tell us what your next goal is. Uh, well, I was kind of, uh, we we're on a team called Brandy and then last night and um, everybody hit whatever senior silver I don't know the ranks yet <laughs> still but um they were hitting all this stuff or whatever and now they're all going for gold and I was sitting there making all my goals for um April and I was sitting there telling my husband I said I think I'm going to keep it to myself which I'm not now I'm going to share it <laughs> but I was like okay. I think I'm going to keep it to myself but I think I'm going to at least shoot for gold so awesome. I'm going to try for gold <laughs> and see where it goes but I do want to say too that I am not like, I'm just going to be honest. I'm not somebody like that people like to follow. Like I don't have a big, huge group of close friends or anything like that. And I got four people in like a week, not even a week probably to start. So just take a jump and try it. <laughs> I think if we have the perspective too, like you never know who's praying for an answer. Then these products, because they reduce inflammation, they address blood sugar and hormone balance. They help with gut health. Like 98%, 99% percent of people could benefit from help in any one of those areas. Oh, not to mention weight management. A lot of people are looking for that. And so I feel like it is a way to serve people. And it is it is kind of a, a surprise. Like, ooh, who's, who are we going to help this week? You know, I always ha had that expectation of like praying and then being like, okay, who am I going to help this week? Like, this is going to be exciting. And so, Renee, I'm so proud of you for being brave and sharing your goal with us. So, yeah, there's people that have double ranked, double ranked last month. They're going to double or triple rank this month. So it's totally doable. Um, and just for the sake of everyone that's listening, let's talk about the jump from silver, silver to senior silver. Do you know how many people you'll need based on last month's th four? How many more you'll need to go senior silver? I don't. Okay, so senior silver is nine 
people total. It's fine. No, totally fine. This, but this will help everyone because a lot of people don't really know our compensation plan and stuff like that yet and the, what the ranks mean. So senior silver is nine total. So based on the fact that you vision casted for your four people that this is going to be a 90 day commitment, they'll all stay on, um, hopefully and order their second month's worth. So then you'll need five more people in order to hit senior silver. And then in order to go gold, that's a total of 17, right? And so we subtract, um, well, how many more would we need? Nine up to 17, eight. I should know these. I should know easy math, right? So, so, but you start to think, well, if you help some of your friends, add a couple of friends. What's going on? I'm getting calls from my family. Oh, okay. I think we're good. <laughs> um, so if you help your, your friends help four friends, you can see how quickly you can get to gold by helping a couple people go silver or helping, you know, four friends help four friends. And actually we have that walking pad. So, I mean, you might as well at least get six friends started and then help a couple friends earn that walking pad also, right? So you can see how quickly you can, you can grow your team. Okay, awesome job. Keep up the great work. I'm gonna actually kick it over to Jennifer Hilton. She is gonna share next because she went senior silver. So Jennifer, tell us how you did it. Interesting fun fact. She was actually in Punta Cana with us as a guest of Becky Weaver's <laughs> and came home. I don't want to steal your thunder though. Oops, you're muted. If you swipe, like touch your screen and then click the little microphone button. There we go. Okay, I think I'm unmuted now. I didn't want to swipe. Hi, I'm Jennifer. Um, uh, I know, um, Megan asked some questions because I was like, well, what are you going to ask? Because, um, you know, I got to be a little prepared. That's the teacher in me of wanting to be prepared tonight because I don't want to just like, uh, I'll be saying, um, um, and sometimes I do that on my live. I've, I've got to get better about not saying, um, but, um, I, she, see, I said it right then. <laughs> uh, she asked me a couple questions about uh, what I thought was hard and what my fear was. Um, I'd say the hardest part for me so far is being sure I'm making time for my business, but also for my family and also for my full-time job because I still have a full-time job and I'm hoping to get rid of that full-time job. So I am going to be driving that Lexus to church. <laughs> I, told, I told everybody, I told Becky the other day, we're going to be the Plexus sisters in our Lexus riding to church. And they're going to say, what? <laughs> but um, that's probably been the hardest, uh, hardest part is making time. Um, I know my goal this month was six. And I actually had to, um, I was going out of the country for a couple weeks. So I made that goal uh, before. And I got it before I left to go. My daughter and I went to Italy for two weeks for vacation and um, it was fun. And so I didn't really work at Plexus except for posting pictures of me at the Leaning Tower of Pisa on the gondola in Italy. So I tried to do that and try just to encourage, you know, people. And I didn't do a lot of messaging that week, but um, I'm back at it now. And um, I said my fear my biggest fear is being pushy and I was afraid of people want, you know, I'm I don't want to push anything on anybody. And um, it's so funny because I've been really talking to this girl at my school and she's a school nurse and uh, she was so excited about doing it. And then all of a sudden she was like, eh, and she had some family problems and I understand that. So today I hadn't seen her in a couple of weeks and I had texted her the other day. Are you, you know, I don't want you to miss out on the March deal. You sh you know, she's like, Oh, well, I still have some, I was like, no problem, girl, no problem. I gotcha. So today she, I saw her in the hallway and I was like, she said, I want to tell you something. I was like, what? You are not, you have not been pushy. And she said, I have done a lot of things and a lot of people have been pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed. And then I back off, but I'm not, I, she said, I'm still interested. Don't give up on me. And so that was one of my things about not giving up and um, making sure you go back and re-message or I just constantly, um, I don't really talk about the plexus all the time. I want to say, well, how you doing? What you been doing? 
lately? Um, do you have any help? Do you need any help in this or that? Or, and then I'll just sort of throw the plexus in there. Cause I don't want to be, I, I, just, I just don't want to be pushed and I don't want it to be pushed on me. So that was my main fear about being pushy. So, and I guess she asked me about some tips. I would say my three tips is the first one is have fun doing it. And that's just my personality of, I like to have fun. I like to do, I like to have fun wherever I go. And I like to treat people with respect and um, always act like I'm happy to see them. I have to say, I always try to tell everybody, um, I'm like my dog, Kona. Anytime you see me, I'm going to be happy to see you because you know what? I wish people were like that all the time because they're not. So I, my dog is always happy to see me, whether I'm in a bad mood or a great mood. So um, that's one thing I've tried to do. And I've been talking to a lot of people in person. I think talking in person, um, they see the how excited I am and how it's doing, how it's changing my life. Because I walked into school today, haven't been there in two weeks. And they're like, oh, man, you look so good. I'm like, yeah. I said, I'm going to get some plexus. I said, come on, come on. I had like five people and I was like, yeah, okay, come on. We're going to keep working, but you know, I'll keep working at them. Can't promise anything. But um, my other thing, I guess another tip was um, always post and share. Um, I'm not afraid to share. I'm not afraid to go alive. Um, let's see. My voice is a little shaky right now because I'm talking so fast, but I, I just think posting People see me happy. People see me, what it's, how it's changing my life. And um, I think sharing is one of my main things I do like about it. And let's see another thing. I said message always. Don't forget to re-message. I wait a couple of days before I message them back. Um, and I, I, I've talked to a couple of my friends on the phone. That's another tip I thought that was good. And always, uh, my last one was always be open to learn. I feel like I am coachable and I guess that's uh, all those evalu teacher evaluations. Oh, you need to do better at this. Okay. Yay. I'm going to, you know, Hey, yes, I can always do better. Um, Cause I always want to strive to do my best and be organized and be, um, be ready for what I'm going to do. So um, I think that's about all that's on my list. I made <laughs> Love um, it. <laughs> and I, guess I, I have a great sponsor, so that's a plus too. So always I and I really liked, I have to say, um, y'all had me in at Putacana. <laughs> when someone asked me, Well, how long you been in Plexus? I said, Oh, a couple hours. <laughs> um, but uh February's great. Um, I wasn't in it but four days and got those seven people then and made that fast start silver. This month I did about eight. And um, so next month I'm going for that gold, maybe even se probably senior goal. I'm going to try. So, and I'm already signed up to go to the um, convention. Already got my plane tickets, got my place. I'm saying I am ready to go. I'm ready to learn. So I guess Perfect. the main thing is just be yourself. <laughs> hey, well, can I join your team? You're just so fun. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you were fun I oh, like all the ladies the ladies were so nice so sweet so she came with Becky to Punta Cana because she was one of Becky's friends with a passport like an existing passport she's like hey you're going I'm in because <laughs> Becky don't like it Becky didn't was afraid to travel so I had to travel and miss and I am a traveling I have the travel bug <laughs> that's awesome well you're gonna love Plexus then because there's lots of travel opportunities if you want them Yes. All right. Thank you for sharing with us, guys. I hope you're taking notes. This is golden. So good. All right. Let's kick it over really quick. Allie, can you unmute? She also went senior silver and I would love for her to share how she did it also, because there's different ways to make it happen, you know? Okay. So I hosted an in-person with Brandy and you, and that's kind of what it was middle of the month, but that's kind of what started it for me. Uh, but I think that was the push that I needed was uh, to have have some join and um, keep push me to keep going. So I started back in December, but kind of got in my own head and worried about what other people thought. And so kind of just backed off and stopped sharing. But Brandy didn't give up on me and um, encouraged me to host the in-home or the in-person. I mean, so I did that. And then... Um, 
let's see, I made some notes here. Basically just, just <laughs> rainy. Basically just decided I didn't care what anybody thought. I this is what I, I want to do it. So I'm just gonna do it and get out of my own head. Uh and then when I started getting real money, as I like to call it, that definitely helps to also like, okay, it's fun to do anyways, but when you're getting paid for it, it definitely helps push you to work a little harder. And then I started getting even testimonies from my customers. And so that definitely is encouraging to keep going. Um, so my biggest fear probably is being pushy, um, seeing people and then like turning away from you, like, oh no, she's going to ask me about Plexus. <laughs> so I've just had to like, I don't know, just keep going. So the tips that I would give is stay consistent. I, um, ever since decided I was just going to share and not care. I have posted on my stories and on my wall every day I've made reels yeah. and um, just stayed consistent that way. And I even had one of my brother-in-laws who was really hard to, well, I guess <laughs> he even messaged and said, okay, I guess your consistency is paying off. So that gave me encouragement to just keep sharing. They're watching whether they're saying anything or not, just keep sharing. So I've done that. Um, and then get uncomfortable. I've definitely gotten very uncomfortable, but it's been worth it. So I had eight people, I think last month, I thought three people was going to be super hard and ended up having eight. So just keep going. Love it. Love it. Love it. Drop a one in the comments. If you've ever felt scared or out of your comfort zone, like I promise you that you're not alone. Ali, obviously like verbalize some of those fears and we're getting ready to hop on a coaching here in a little bit and we're going to talk about like some mindset surrounding some of those fears but real quick before um our last two girls share is the fear of being pushy is an awareness factor that is there to help you not be that way <laughs> um the other thing i would just encourage you is to build your belief because if you truly believe how life-changing these products can be for people and how life-changing the, the business opportunity can be for people, it's going to crowd out the little head chatter in the back of your head going, uh, 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 right? So pop into our testimony pages, refresh your memory on like why you're sharing what you're sharing. And when you have the motive of love compelling you, it's not going to come across that way. I never once thought my sponsor was pushy. Or annoying. She was the master and the queen of follow-up and she signed up nagging off. <laughs> okay. I'm not anything, but I'm just saying like, you never know who your next diamond is going to be that you sign up. Maybe even as a product customer, you know, product user, that's what I was at, at the beginning. And so, um, just be willing to do that follow-up because follow-up is professional. You're not being pushy, but you, you probably need to coach your mind a little bit about that and get some training on it. Anytime that I had like a question or just a concern or a fear, I would go to YouTube and type in Plexus fear <laughs> or Plexus and follow-up and just binge listen to some of those trainings because it really gave me some other perspectives to consider besides just my own head chatter, you know? Okay. Going to kick it over to Sarissa. Okay. We have like four minutes left. So really quick, Sarissa, I would love for you to share. She ranked up to senior gold. All right. We're kind of hitting on all the ranks here, which is so fun. All right. Are you still there? I thought I saw her pop on. I know she was hopping on a little late. I'm here. Hey. Okay. Okay. I just want to start off with uh, other people don't pay your bills. So whatever you need to do to get to where you want to be, that's on you. Don't worry about other people. Um, but this was not easy. This took me about two years. And I mean, I maintained gold like for a, a whole year. And I never really got momentum until I just started messaging people short phrases and I like, kept it very simple. And I was also that quote unquote probably annoying person that just kept asking, <laughs> asking people, hey, I know you were interested. So, I mean, is now the time? Um, but I also put a lot of like work into learning more with how to like message. Um, on the one team page, I looked up a lot of videos. I watched a lot of videos. I took a lot of notes. Um, and then I just started doing more like customer care, didn't give up, and also messaging more about the business. 
Um, I had, I think, five people rank up on my team last month. But, I mean, I messaged a lot about the business and about the opportunity. And I really think that's what helped with the momentum and, I mean, helped me not do all the work because I, again, started from the ground up. I knew no one. I was, like, a recluse in my bedroom. And so getting 14 to, I think, 14 to 15 signups last month, after two years of being in the business, I mean, it's very encouraging. So there's, there's someone out there that wants to uh, have money or wants to not have migraines or GI issues or whatever. So just keep reaching out and keep believing in people. So. Love it. Love it. So good, Sarissa. And by the way, she had five people rank up to on her team, which when you go senior gold, and Ruby and beyond, like it can't just be you anymore. <laughs> you have to get that duplication going. So I love that you made those necessary pivots and trained yourself in those areas. Okay, really fast. We're going to kick it over to Ruby ambassador, Molly Anderson. I cannot wait for her to share with you. And then we'll um, end this and start our new ambassador training. Hi. Okay, so I'm going to try and make this really quick. I wrote down some notes while we were chatting. So um, uh, so I remember when I first started, Megan shared, you're not posting too much. Like, don't ever feel like you're like, like if you're posting once a day, post again. Like it doesn't matter because you never know what is going to like, uh, like you just never know when somebody's going to see something and it's going to click with them. Um, and then like, it doesn't matter what others think about you. Like, it, like, it just doesn't matter. Like Sarissa said, like, they're not the ones paying your bills. And if you have a dream, if you have a goal, go for it. Like, it's not just because it's um, scary. Like, you have a team of people who are going to be there for you to support you in that area, too. Um, and then, like, a big thing, like, write down your goals, so like in January, Megan had us write down our goals for 30, 60, and 90 days. And so um, like I still have it in my journal right here. And it's like my goal for June was to be Ruby. And so like I hit it in March. Like <laughs> so like when you've written down your goals, it's really awesome to look back on them and be like, oh my word, like that's amazing. Like I did this, like this is possible. And um, and then another thing, like when you feel like you're down and you want to give up because I've been feeling that way, like just in my brain, like I get in my head sometimes. And so when you feel like you just want to give up, reach out to your VIPs and ask for a testimony. Be like, hey, what are you seeing? How, like what's going on? What are some things that you've noticed since you started your products? Because when they respond to you, like I just had a girl respond to me um, and I knew that she had allergies. And I just saw her message and she literally said, more energy, no bloating, no constipation. I was outside Sunday for two hours and no allergy issues. And I was like, that's amazing. So like, that's why I keep sharing and that's why I keep talking to people because of testimonies like this. And so if you start to feel like you just can't do this anymore and you're like, your business isn't going anywhere, reach out to your people and talk to them because they are the ones that are going to push you forward and make you feel like, okay, I, I'm serving a purpose here. I am blessing my friends with these products. And um, yeah, so, and then like cast your vision. So I've sold Plexus before and I did not have a vision. Like I did not see that in my brain. And so um, I'm a teacher also. And when I finally said, I'm done with teaching and I'm ready to get out of this, that's when I took off. And I like really like said, okay, I'm all in. Because when I saw that, oh my gosh, I can quit teaching when I hit this certain rank, like, like that's equal to my salary right now, I'm, I've am i gone for it. Like, and so I'm literally a rank away now from being able to quit teaching. And uh, because that was my, me and my husband's agreement. And so um, when you set goals like that and you set a vision, it pushes you so much farther than you think you could ever go. And like, it's so scary, but if it wasn't scary, it wouldn't be a goal. Like it wouldn't be big enough. If your dreams don't make you scared, your dream isn't big enough. So um, yeah, um, and then another like really quick, sorry, I know I'm talking a lot. I'm trying to go fast. 
Um, when God is in the details, the facts don't matter. And that I did a training back in March, I think, no, February, January, that, um, that uh, Emily told us that. And that really stuck with me. Like, oh my word, I have to sign up 50 people this month. That doesn't matter. Like if God is in this, then it doesn't matter. And so I fully believe in that. And then prayer, pray over your people, pray over who is going to come into your life. Because I, the people that are working under me now, I had no relationship with them like before this. And now all of a sudden they're like my best friends. And so pray for those people to come into your life. Um, And I think that that was, oh, and uh, just because someone doesn't respond to you doesn't mean you didn't plant a seed. Um, so it just keep, keep reaching out and keep talking to people. And I've noticed that even if they aren't responding to me, something, something magical happens. And, uh, like 99% of the people that I have signed up or have been people who have reached out to me, not people I've talked to or reached out to, but they, um, like, there's just something that happens when you start reaching out to people, they just start coming to you. And I, I don't know what, what that is but they do so um yeah Sorry. awesome thank you for sharing and congratulations on ranking up this to ruby what is your next goal so um i just wrote it down uh because i've already met the current one so april is senior ruby may is a thousand point club and june is emerald Woo! <laughs> love it love it love it love it all right, we got to pop off because we're starting our new ambassador training. But I have, I forgot I had these. I ordered the Phil Jones is exactly what to say, and I have four of them. So my team, message me your April gold and your goals for quarter two. Message me privately, and I will pick four winners for this book. All right, we're going to wrap it up. Thank you all for sharing. Congratulations on all of those wins, and I cannot wait to see everybody win in April. Okay, we're going to st we're going to stop the recording but don't leave. I'm just going to start the new recording for the new ambassador coaching.